scary situation. Eyewitnesses report that some guy named Mika, or Mikael, this guy is hanging on the end of a cliff with wolves next to him. Nobody knows how he got there, but he's hanging there and he can't get up because the wolves can attack him at any moment. The rescue team can't get there in time because there is a terrible wind in the area and the chopper is being blown away. They're trying to do everything they can to save our victim. There were some brave men who tried to save our friend, but unfortunately the wolves are cruel and they destroyed them very quickly. If anyone has the opportunity, hurry up and help the man before the wolves get to him. Take care of yourselves. Oh my God, it's my friend Mikey and it looks like he's in danger. I've got to go and rescue him right now. But unfortunately, I can't do anything because I don't have a gun. I don't have anything. But I have an idea how I can help him. And I'm going to use blocks to help me. I'll create a golem and control it. Ha 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 ha. That's funny, but it'll be like my power armor. I'll control the golem, and in that state, I'll have a much better chance of destroying the wolves and saving Mikey. And I'll build a golem using blocks of iron and a pumpkin. No! I'm going to build a reinforced golem with stronger materials like this metal. Why this kind of material? Because they're more durable and can take a lot more damage than a normal golem. And this will help me against animals like wolves. There's a lot of them out there, and I have to deal with them somehow. Because if I don't, Mikey's probably finish. And I have to do it as fast as possible because every second counts. Great! Now it looks exactly the way it's supposed to. Now I need to drink the shrinking potion so I can jump to the golem's head. And then I'll tap into its brain to control it. And then I'll have to test its abilities a little bit because I don't know anything about this stuff yet. Ah, how did Mikey get in there in the first place? And why didn't he call me as he went on his such unique adventures? Now he's in huge trouble. Whoa, well, it turns out I'm in the golem's head. But it's kind of empty and there's no leverage. That makes sense because my job is to build this place myself. And for that, I've brought all the necessary tools. First, I'll install a laptop. I'll use it to control and manage the golem. But to make it work, I need to install the adapters and then just run a bunch of redstone to connect directly to the brain. Well, thanks to all this clever and magical stuff, I can control the golem and take advantage of all its features and abilities. Oh yeah, that's right. The golem must have tons of different abilities. I know what a normal golem can do, but this one, the enhanced one? So what do we have here? Looks like we're all set, right? Or is it? Yeah, yeah, well, I've done it, and I can control the golem now. Great! So this golem can walk. Yes, it's a cool ability, and I noticed it a long time ago, but the golem can climb walls. Now that's a surprise, which means it's going to be easy for me to climb. What else do we have? Well, I'm kind of strong. I have a lot of health. I have a lot of... I'm very strong and I'm gonna break all the wolves' faces so they'll never touch Mikey again. And then we'll have to teach Mikey a lesson because where did he get to and how did he get there? I have no idea how he could have run into wolves in the mountains. I don't know what he did to them. So, Mikey's gotta be around here somewhere. I heard screaming. Ah! Yeah, I think those are the wolves. They're waiting for Mikey to get up. He can't fall because he's too high. Hey, you dirty clowns, get away from my friend. Hey, you. Oh, yeah. How can they understand me? They're just stupid dogs with a little time to live because I'm so mad at them. Yeah, you think you're so strong? And you can't do it. Take that, you stupid animals. Yeah, looks like I'm getting pretty good at fighting them. They're not so dangerous anymore. No, they're not. They're very dangerous. Oh my god! Oh no! My leg! Oh my god! What a horror! Jay! Is that you? JJ, can you help me? Oh my god, Mikey! Are you okay? I think I'm in trouble! My leg! Or rather, the golem's leg just took a... Oh my god! The wolf bit off the golem's leg! What am I supposed to do now? Golem, come on! Get up! I can't get out of the golem because it's dangerous and I drank the reduction potion! I need to save Mikey now! Oh my god, Mikey, hang in there! I'm coming to you! I'm in trouble here! Are you alright? What golem? 
What are you talking about, JJ? Hang in there, Mikey. I'm gonna save you. Grab the golem. Hey, Mikey, climb up on my arm and try to pull yourself up. I can't pull you up because I don't have a leg. Oh my god, JJ, it's so good to see you. But what happened to you? And why are you a golem? I'm just controlling the golem so I can save you safely. But there's the golem's leg. As you may have noticed, the wolves bit off the leg. Whoa, what a mess you're in. Thank you so much for helping me. Yeah, but I could use some help myself right now. I need to do something about my leg. Let me try to fix your leg somehow. What if I try to do something like this? I'd really appreciate it, Mikey, because I can't even walk, as you can see. It's going to be all right now, so you don't have to worry, my friend. What now? Yeah, Mikey, thank you for helping me out. Thank you for not leaving me here, and how the rescue team couldn't get here. Yeah, I'm surprised, too. You were on TV. That's how I knew you were in trouble. Is awesome. Thank you so much again. Now let's get out of here. You need medical attention. Uh, you could use some too, ha ha ha. I don't know how much longer I could have hung on like this. I'm surprised I survived. Well, turns out you're strong and you were confident. So you did good. And now let's just go. Ah! Oh my God. Mikey, oh no, what happened? JJ, help me. I think I'm in trouble again. Oh my Ouch. God, Mikey, hang on. How could this happen? Watch your step. Didn't you see where you were going? Oh, JJ, I'm in a lot of pain. What's wrong with me? I think you fell from a great height. Maybe you broke something, but let's not talk about it. Fight it, Mikey. Fight like you fought when you were hanging from the edge of the cliff. I want you to survive. I'm taking you to the hospital right now. I hope I'm okay, right? Yeah, sure, Mikey. I'm gonna get you there in time to get you some repairs. And then you can tell me what's going on with you today. Well, here we are. How are you feeling? Are you still alive? Hey, hello, doctor. Please help my friend. He fell off a cliff, and it looks like he's in trouble. Whoa, isn't that the legend that was on the news? He did fall off a cliff? Well, then take him to the room. We'll treat. Not quite. I saved him from the wolves, but... The irony is that when we went home, he did not notice the cliff and fell while talking to me. I'll fix you too. It's pretty rare to see a talking golem save his friend these days. They don't even know my friend is inside the golem. Yeah, you didn't realize it right away either. Anyway, you lie down and you should be fine. I'll hope so. The doctor seems like a normal guy. I think I'm gonna make it. You're safe now, so you're gonna make it. The doctor will treat you. He's gonna be fine. But first I need to use this potion. And here's an apple. Take it and eat it so your body will heal faster. Thank you so much, Doc, for your help. I'll be sure to bring you the money and the reward. Golem! You can basically go wait outside. You don't want to see that, but don't go far. I'll fix you up later, too. Oh, okay, Doc. Thanks again for that. Uh, looks like Mikey's gonna be okay. Well, I kinda hope so. Eh, uh, that doctor's a funny guy, though. He really deserves an award. Thank you again, Doctor, for your help. We'll be sure to bring you the money. Thanks, Doc. I'll come by tomorrow and give you all the money you need. Wait. Where are you going? I was going to fix you, too. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot about that. I've never seen a golem repaired before. Mikey, you stay here, and I'll go sit over there for a while, okay? Anyway, tell me what happened. I saved Mikey, but I had to fight the wolves. They scratched me, and one wolf bit my leg off. But good thing Mikey tried to sew my leg back on or something. I can walk now. It must have hurt like hell, huh? How can you walk after that? Well, get over here. I'll make your leg look like a new one. Yeah? Well, come on, Doc. I'm ready. Make me a beast again. It's gonna hurt a little bit, but not so much that it hurts like hell. Anyway, how's it feel now? Nope, it just tickles. Ah, is that normal? And why do I feel what a golem feels? <laughs> it seems like you can't feel pain. Well, then we could do useful experiments on you and you wouldn't feel any pain at all. Ah, if it would help you, that's fine with me, cause I don't have time for that right now. I gotta figure out what we're gonna do with Mikey later. I wanna ask him how he ended up on that rock. It's so crazy that he was surrounded by wolves. Your friend is a legend. The whole village is talking about him. If they see him, they'll write legends about him. And now you can run and jump like you used to. So good luck to you. 
Thank you so much, Doc. I'll come to you tomorrow with the money. So wait for me. Hey, Mikey. Why are you standing there so sad? What's wrong? Oh, JJ, are you free yet? Would you like a carrot? These carrots are so good. Yeah, thank you, but not. I have a serious question for you. How did you end up on the edge of a cliff? Uh, it's a long story. I found out that the wolves' den has some valuable stones like diamonds and gold. And you decided to go there alone, didn't you? Uh, yeah. I didn't want to disturb you. And I did, because there was no one in the lair. But then how did they catch you? How did the wolves find you? Uh, they were waiting for me on the way out. I distracted them, and when they left, I ran and made a huge mistake. I didn't think of anything clever but to run up the cliff. I thought they wouldn't get me there. Where's the lair? We can try to go there. Are you serious now? I could show you. Follow me, but there are wolves out there. They're very dangerous. Are you sure about that? Look at me. I'm walking power armor. Jay, have you forgotten how your leg got bitten off? It's not too late to change your mind, my friend. Hey, watch out. Are you seeing them too, or am I hallucinating? Yes, wolves. Where are they going? Probably to the very cave you were talking about. Let's follow them. We're going to follow the wolves? It's funny to hear that, frankly. Oh, yeah. You were right after all. They've come to that very cave. Well, I showed it to you so we can go back, right? No. We'll go that way. Or at least I'm going that way. I want to find the diamonds. Are you crazy? It's dangerous. You don't want to risk your life like that. It's too late, Mikey. I've made up my mind. You can go back in there, but I'm definitely going in there. Hey, what are you doing out there? I'm not leaving you alone. I know you're wearing a huge layer of metal and your armor is huge, but... You're right. It'll be a lot easier on the two of us. But stay close to me at all times and don't go anywhere. Especially since I have to get back at those stupid dogs for what I've been through. I won't let them live in peace either. That's right. Can you tell me exactly where the stones are? The exact location? I can show you exactly where they are, but... You go first! I've suffered enough already. I'm not going first. Mikey, no one's even gonna argue. So get next to me and just watch the sides, because the wolves might surround us. Come on, JJ. I'm gonna put my faith in you. So I'm gonna look around and tell you where they are. Mikey, look the way you came. Where are the diamonds? JJ, there's a strange passage to your left. I haven't been there. Maybe we should go that way. Okay, I have a better plan. So we're gonna explore this cave completely. I think we should find out what else is in here. Find out all the secrets. Great, but let's be careful because it's very dangerous in here. I wish I had armor like yours. I'd be able to help you in a big way. I can't see anything yet, but I think there's a body over there. Should we check it out? I'm fine. Thank you for freeing me. I can't believe people came for me. Well, first of all, they didn't come for you. They came for the diamonds. And secondly, we're also surprised that you somehow survived. There are other people in the cave. I know that because I've seen wolves bringing them here. So be careful. There are more people here? Are you serious? Not that they survived because I heard screaming. I should probably go, okay? Can I? Of course you can go. Just don't get trapped again. We can't save you a second time. If you find me in the village not far from here, I'll give you a reward. So there are more people in this cave? So we'll look for them, right? Well, I think we should try to find something here after all. Suddenly, our mission has turned into a rescue operation. Maybe he's right and no one survived. Hey, JJ, I think there's a human in here too. And judging by the skeletons around him, he's still alive. He doesn't even have a scratch on him. How did the wolves get them here? Why didn't they eat them right away? Why did they bring them to this cave? You guys get out of here! It's dangerous and there are no diamonds here! What do you mean there are no diamonds? Where are they? Uh, we're actually saving you! So grab your stuff and get out of here before you get in more trouble! Thank you again! Good luck to you guys! I'll never forget this! God bless you! Yeah, but what I don't get is, what do you mean there's no diamonds? Where are they? Jay, I'm sure no one's found them, but I've seen them. I also see another survivor. Let's hurry up and help him. Hey, you. Come on, get up and get your stuff. You're getting out of here and you're never coming back, you understand? I can't believe it. Thanks, guys. Thanks again. Go on, get out of here. Don't waste our time. Well, do you think we've rescued everyone? Or are there still some left? Uh, I have 
have no idea. Let's just take another look around the cave. But I think I saw a huge wolf up ahead. Like it was the boss of the location. Oh no! Careful, Mikey. One wrong move can lead to a fatal mistake. Work together. Come on, Mikey. Let's take this monster down. Hey, JJ. It's gotta be some kind of pack leader. Look how big it is. Yeah, I can see that. You better get behind him and hit him from behind. That way you'll do more damage to his vulnerable spots. Ah, there was a key in here. And it looks like this key opens the chest. Yes. Well, hurry up and open it and let's see what's in there. It's probably just what I told you about. There's treasure in there. Well, let's see if you were right or wrong. I was right because I saw it. What is it? Why don't you take a look at it? There's a lot of stuff in there. There's enough to last us a lifetime. Cool, JJ. Let's take it all with us. It was totally worth it. Woo! Hey, hey, watch it. Don't throw your money around or you could easily lose it. <laughs> 